Good evening. This is Luke Thomas Holmquist here at the Earthquake Forecast Center, quakeprediction.com. And it is uh, 8.06 in the evening, Monday, February 7th, 2022, 8.06 p.m. Monday, February 7th, 2022. Monday, February 7th. <laughs> All right. Here we go. This is the forecast that is valid through today. And we're still expecting uh, some quakes down there. We did get the, uh, the 3.6 earthquake just southeast of Los Angeles. Uh, I believe that was yesterday. Let's see. Right here, this one here. Trabuco, Trabuco Canyon. And here it is right here. 3.6 hit east southeast of Los Angeles and east of Long Beach. And uh, we're working on the magnitudes, uh, the magnitude of the quakes, um, but uh, that verified this uh, area of risk here and that spike in risk. And uh, now the risk tomorrow, the 8th through the 11th, still high risk in the south near the Salton Sea, but we have a uh, very high risk near the San Francisco Bay, San Francisco on the 8th through the 11th. And when it says the 8th through the 11th, uh, unless it's a really big earthquake, it's most likely to take place during the first uh, couple of days there of the forecast, the 8th or the 9th. And so pretty high risk in uh, San Francisco Bay on the 8th into the 9th. And then pretty uh, significant area of risk here on the 9th into the 10th. And we'll have more information on this tomorrow but uh, very high risk in the area just northwest of uh, Los Angeles. So the 98% risk goes from like Santa Barbara down to Irvine and over to uh, Barstow, centered uh, just northwest of Los Angeles. So this is a very significant area of risk and we'll have more details on this uh, tomorrow, but this could produce a 5.0 earthquake or larger on the 9th or the 10th. And uh, we'll get back to you on that, but uh, tomorrow specifically, pretty high risk in the San Francisco Bay and down near the Salton Sea as well. All right, in Alaska, uh, this risk was very high on the 6th through the 9th. And we mentioned that on the Alaska forecast page, uh, very high risk in Anchorage. And they got a 5.2 just north of Anchorage on that day. And now the risk from the 7th through the 10th is over here near Juneau and west of Anchorage. And then on the 8th through the 11th, it's like southwest of Juneau and southeast of Anchorage out here in the Gulf of Alaska. In Greece, high risk in north central Greece, the 8th and the 9th, and then uh, down near Crete on the 9th and 10th, just east of Crete on the 9th and 10th. Um, very high risk uh, northeast of Santiago on the 7th through the 10th of February, just northeast of uh, Santiago, we could get a significant quake here. 5.0 is possible northeast of Santiago. And in Indonesia, we have a very, very strong area of risk here. And when you see this large of a risk, you know something, uh, a big earthquake is gonna happen. <clears throat> and so yesterday we issued a warning for Indonesia, uh, Sumatra area for the 7th or the 11th. Now, today, or during the last 24 hours, we got a 4.6 here which is not verifying that uh, risk area. I mean, it's, it's verifying the right area there so far, but this is a much, much bigger area of risk. So expecting a 6.0 to 7.0, this is the latest forecast map. Much more serious situation. You can see the 98% risk has grown um, tremendously across uh, Southern Sumatra um, and just northwest of Jakarta. So, <coughs> excuse me, very high risk 
in Indonesia, expecting a 6.0 to 7.0 February 8th through the 11th. And <clears throat> if you have friends or family that live in there in that area, uh, expect this earthquake to hit between the 8th and the 11th, 8th, 9th, 10th, or 11th, and most likely sooner than later. So we'll see what happens there. Uh, strong quake coming to Indonesia. We've been talking about this in uh, Italy for a couple of days. It looks like it's coming together for a 5.0 as possible on February 7th, today or tomorrow the 8th. So we'll keep an eye out for that. Strong earthquake, about 5.0 is possible in the area uh, north of Naples and uh, kind of here in central, central Italy. In uh, the Peru and Ecuador forecast, there was a 78% risk in Ecuador. I believe we got a, let's take a look at that over there. A 4.1, uh, late on the 6th into the 7th. Um, let's see, where are we here? Indonesia, Italy, Peru. Here we go. And hit right in this area here on this forecast. And I believe there's also an earthquake uh, south of Peru here as well. Uh, I'll check that later. But uh, that's the forecast for Peru and uh, Japan. Risk is here in the far south uh, on the 6th through the 9th. And then the risk uh, moves to uh, the Morioko, Morioka, uh, Aomori, Akita, Sendai area of northern Japan on the 7th through the 10th. All right, yeah, there, there's that quake that hit uh, there uh, south of Peru there in Bolivia. And that matched up with this high risk area here in the south part of Peru. All right, <clears throat> excuse me. So let's take a quick look at that again. We have uh, this 3.6 earthquake that hit in Southern California verifying this risk area. It's not as large as uh, I thought it was going to be. Uh, however, something still could hit today in this forecast, 4th through the 7th. Risk is still high down there through the 7th. Then on the 8th and 9th of February, the risk is building here near San Francisco, 79% risk in San Francisco, so pretty high risk there. Could get a 4.0 is possible there, and still pretty high risk down in the Salton Sea. And this is more of a serious situation on the 9th into the 10th, where we get a 5.0 earthquake near Los Angeles on the 9th and 10th. And we'll have more information on that tomorrow. And let's see, in Greece, northern Greece, a high risk there. In Chile, just northeast of Santiago, Indonesia, looking for a very strong major earthquake, uh, the 7th through the 11th. And here's a better map of it here. The 8th through the 11th, looking for a strong earthquake, 6.0 to 7.0 in uh, southern Sumatra and uh, northwest of Jakarta. That's a serious situation there. Italy could get a 5.0 in central Italy during the next uh, 24 to 36 hours. And Japan's risk is on the far south, moving to the north on the 7th through the 10th. All right. So... <laughs> Thanks for joining us today. Keep an eye on that Indonesia earthquake, big quake coming to Indonesia and uh, Southern California on the 9th and 10th, uh, looking for very high risk on the 9th and 10th down there near Northwest of Los Angeles. Uh, we'll get, have some more information on that tomorrow. Central Italy, about a 5.0 there. And uh, we'll keep you updated, keep you informed here at uh, quakeprediction.com. We'll talk to you again tomorrow. And thanks for your support.